Number 10, Bianca Belair, Naomi, and Jade Cargill versus Damage Control. As someone who attended WrestleMania 33 for one of the reasons of seeing Naomi win the SmackDown Women's Championship in her hometown, as someone who has made content of having nothing but praise for the absolute bangers Bianca Belair has put on in her previous three WrestleMania appearances, as someone who is a fan of Jade Cargill's work in AEW, and as someone who is a fan of Damage Control, the hype for this match was very much real for me. However, unlike Damage Control's six-woman tag match from the previous year featuring Becky Lynch, Bayley, Trish Stratus, and Lita, this one was not as good. But by no means does that make it a bad match because the mission was very much understood here as this was a showcase for Jade Cargill. Plus, Bianca Belair's performance in the match was excellent as always. It was also great to see Naomi, Dakota Kai, Kairi Sane, and Asuka Asuka highlighted in this match as well. Speaking of Asuka, is it not crazy that the most decorated woman in WWE history is one of the most defeated women in WrestleMania history? However, on a much brighter side, with Jade Cargill picking up the win, there are some astonishing facts for the winning team, such as Jade now being undefeated at WrestleMania. Yeah, wanna know, but still, it's a true fact. Naomi and Bianca Belair have now tied Trish Stratus and Charlotte Flair for the most female wins in WrestleMania history, with each woman having four wins apiece. If you count Naomi being the winner of the women's WrestleMania Battle Royal back at WrestleMania 34, which then when it comes into this particular win for Bianca Belair, if you don't include that Battle Royal, which she lost, basically going off of nine kickoff slash pre-show matches, she is now standing at a 4-0 record, having surpassed Sable for becoming the most undefeated woman in WrestleMania history. Yes, I know that's convoluted, but those are the records. Thus, I still stand by my claim that Bianca Belair is no doubt Miss WrestleMania.